Guys, we're going Duras for like a day, maybe two days. <laughs> what we're packing a suitcase. We're in a rush right now. Hey, baby. Hi. Remind me what I need to bring. Oh, <laughs> charger for the camera. We haven't moved in like two weeks, so right now I'm packing a overnight bag right here. Got my boxes, laptop, everything like that. Gaudi's packing her suitcase. The driver's outside. I told him we're gonna be an extra like two minutes, three minutes, because this is what we're actually doing. So <laughs> hopefully he doesn't watch this and be like, oh, you made me wait. <laughs> Doris, here we come. Uh, yo, shout out to Noisy for arranging all of this, sending a driver. We're going over to his restaurant right now. We're gonna check out the spot, eat some sushi. It's gonna be such a dope experience. Let's go, baby. to have some sushi. I had like the best nap ever. So good. Oh my god. Mm-hmm. Where'd you guys get the shrimp from? It's Yo, amazing. I know you guys be fishing this for yourself, innit? <sighs> you went fishing for this by yourself. That fresh shrimp. Mm, you know what though? In Zins, they be playing the bangers though. You got me raving out here. <laughs> something different guys we can't talk too much because the songs are going to get copyrighted but we just want to say this seafood platter is amazing we've got more sushi coming on the way the cocktails are amazing the vibes are amazing the songs are lit this is one of the best restaurant experiences i've had so shout out to noisy shout out to zen shout out to the whole team we appreciate you it's lit let's go UK family, so we had our first bad experience with someone in uh, in, in Albania. Albania. <laughs> yeah, literally in Albania. We went to a hotel that we were meant to be staying at. Like we arranged everything with their PR team. What's the hotel name? Iliad Hotel. Yeah, so we arranged everything with them. They said we can come tonight. We got there, um, and they said that because we don't have our IDs, we can't stay. And obviously they know who we are. He said they, he knows, he can see in front of him that the room's booked for us, but because we don't have our IDs, we can't stay. Which on a low key, I can understand. You know, we, we are donuts if yeah. we got our ID in Tirana. But I had a, I had a, like a, a copy of my ID on my phone, a file, so I could have sent it to him, emailed it to him. But he said, no, he wasn't having it. I think he woke up on the wrong side of the bed, you know what I'm saying, but. And it was being quite rude about it. Like yeah. there's one thing that say like, guys, you know, I really wish I could help you, but I like, just. This is policy, like, yeah. that's understandable. That's understandable, but he was like. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, okay, bro. Literally, People so. don't bite me. Bro, like he fully was ready to leave us out on the street. Like it's, it's past 10 PM now. He's ready to leave us out on the street. We're nowhere to stay. Obviously, we'd find someone to stay, but he didn't know that. Do you know what I'm saying? But he didn't care in the world. So that was a bad experience. But you know, it's just. But luckily for us, luckily we had someone us. in our presence that knew Albanian and mm -hmm. took care of us and brought us to a better hotel yes, sir. where the hospitality was amazing. Impeccable. Is amazing. Shout out to Noisy's team. Shout out to Eri because they sorted everything out. They got us this beautiful hotel. It's a boutique hotel and spa. We're going to walk ourselves to a hotel room now. 
So I think it's here actually. How do I open the door? It's okay, like let me open it. Okay. Why well, Gaudi does this, like I was saying, Zins was amazing. Thank you for the hospitality. Everyone was just so kind, so lovely. The cocktails were amazing. The sushi was amazing. The raw fish was incredible. There's nothing bad to say about Zins. Like, it's just amazing. And we visited during the night time. We had a little tour of the outside bit during the night and it was incredible. So we finally managed to open the door. Guys, this is so romantic, so beautiful. I am in love. Wow. There's a bathtub on the floor. I always wanted a room with a bathtub on the floor. That's nuts. I wonder if it works. It should do because there's like. Oh. Is it for display? No, something comes out. Well, it works. A little something. I'm mad. <laughs> oh crap! Hey, right, careful, 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 careful! Oh no! Oh no! Okay, no! <laughs> oh no! Okay, Baby, no. stop playing with the water. I can tell this bed's going to be no extra comfy. I have no idea what boutique meant until now. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if there's a view. Wow, there's wow, a balcony. No and way. And we have a palm tree right in front of us. Wow. Guys, we got this whole balcony to ourselves. Guys, you must come see the shower, the bathroom right now. Are you ready for the one and only bathroom? Oh my, my goodness. goodness. Guys, we have like a huge walk-in shower. The shower is gold. Like, oh my God, people can see me shower through here. Hi, I'm gonna say hi to you all. Babe, look at this toilet. It's wrapped up in gold. What? Bro, we have a gold toilet. And a gold toilet. Hey, Look at this. It got a sticker on the toilet paper. Mad. Wait, what's in here? Yo. Let's let's show that we I think I might have found the treasure. You ready? I don't know why I'm still in my jacket. I got too excited. Ta da da da. This is sounds so cute. Wow. This oh my gosh. Dental set. If you know me from Cyprus, you already know I like these things. Once again, shout out to Noisy's team. We really appreciate you. Every Noisy's dad, everybody, like, you guys are just amazing. Seriously, like, the hospitality, the love you guys are showing us, we appreciate it so much. As people that come from the bottom and work hard, it truly means a lot. Yes, Seriously. Guys, thank like, you, so you guys much. are letting us go toilet on a gold toilet right now. Oh, poor gold toilet. It's gonna get cacao. <laughs> <laughs> We got a and fireplace we as well. Fireplace? Yo, this is lit. Okay. All right. Yes, sir. Right. Oh wow, we got robes. We got the slippers. We got slippers, like gentlemen. The robes, these are soft as well. I love that. Early the next morning. The guys setting up for business down there. Big mosque over there. Who we'll prays to the Most High? Whoa, he's barking at me. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Who are you, who you talking to? I'll slap you up. I wouldn't slap him up, really. <laughs> You'd win in a fight. Breakfast time. Yes, I'm starving. So they've got a really cool breakfast menu. They have pitula, and a lot of the told us that we should try pitula, so I might just try it. It's for why not? <laughs> Beautiful, I can't wait to try it. And oh my god, I forgot to tell you guys, but this is like the first large orange juice I've ever had in like a restaurant. They usually just serve like a little glass. I'm like, well, thanks. It's amazing. <laughs> Petula. <laughs> yeah, you guys have been asking us to try Petula, so I guess now's the time. Should I try it? Yeah. Okay. So we're a bit afraid that it might taste like the bulls that we ate in um, Cyprus. <laughs> we yeah, didn't so eat bulls in Cyprus. <laughs> There was like little uh, dough it was balls. Like, it was like pancake balls like these and we didn't really like it. I don't know, it had like a weird taste. So I hope it doesn't taste like that. Anyways, let's go for it. 
It does not taste like that. It's good? Mm, oh, I'm so happy. Good. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God, they're so good. Yes. You were amazing. And right now, I'm editing as well. I'm editing Food Talk Part 2. So make sure you guys like and comment on that video. So what's this? No, wait. That's jelly. Jam. It's jelly? It's jam. Jelly jam. Right, I'm trying with honey. Yeah, try with honey. So much better. That's good, dope. right? They're soft, it just it's soft and warm, it just squashes in your mouth. That's it. I feel like a food critique. <laughs> Gordon Ramsay now. This is Cowdy's attempt to try to run a bar. No, I need to make sure it's hot. Guys, we need to take some pictures. It's Instagram time. I have taken the responsibility to look after our Instagram feed and I will make it look amazing. She's actually doing a really good job with the pictures though. Very good job. Okay, this is not turning hot. No? No, why not? Freezing. Put your hand in there. Ah. It wasn't working because we found out that it's actually cold, is hot, and pound is cold. <laughs> why is it a pound sign? All right, guys, we've made TikToks, we've had breakfast, we've uploaded a video, we've done all of our morning routine that we usually do in every other place that we've been. Yes. And now it's time to explore duress and see what the city is all about. But let me tell you what it's about for real, for real. History, baby. It's about the history. history. This is one of the oldest cities in Albania. 3,000, over 3,000 years of this history. This is crazy. Yeah. Like, crazy. I was just looking at the pictures on stairs and I was like, oh my God, that's so beautiful. I want to see everything. So all the Dante and I are not really big history people and we don't really know much about history. Mm. We're going to try our best to look some things up mm. and yeah. <laughs> Fun fact, I really don't like history. Like I dropped history when I had the option to in school, but mm. like I enjoy learning about things. So I Googled some historical facts about Duras and it's really, really interesting. Like the amount of historical things they have here is just yeah. like amazing. So we're gonna visit a few places. But it's time for a first impression. I'm so excited. We had an amazing stay at this hotel. It was so, so beautiful, good. so amazing. Everyone is too. so nice. Anyways, guys, we're gonna go now. We're gonna leave our bags in the reception because they were very kind to do that for us. So yeah, thank you so let's much. Go. Valentino I think it's up this way. One thing I've noticed is that everyone smokes. Literally everyone smokes. You just walk through smoke every time. That's why I bought a perfume, guys, because my hair would not stop smelling of smoke. So I had to run into a perfume shop and buy perfume because I was like, I'm tired of my hair smelling like smoke. <laughs> Did you trip over the dog? <laughs> Did you trip over the dog? I didn't trip over him, no, no. I stopped myself before I saw him. Oh, wow. <laughs> Guys, this is so beautiful. This city is really, really beautiful. Oh my god. Let's go. You can imagine how beautiful this place must be during the summer. Like 30 degree heat just whacking on your head like whew, beautiful. Baby, are you okay? I'm okay. My tracksuit's not okay though. Let me see. Bro. What's wrong with it? It lost color? Yeah, it's like, it's just grazed. Oh, I'm okay. He cares about his tracksuit. I just care about him making sure he's okay. Are you okay? Let me yeah, see I your hands. Yeah, I fell on my hands. Do you want a cream? No, I'm okay. Let me, let me check my leg. Oh, Ooh. no, 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 no. My baby. Ooh. No, stop, stop, stop. How did you do that? Uh oh. <laughs> DK Adventures, baby. <laughs> you know what? We're in high spirits. We're in Duras right now. It's funny because in Tirana, <laughs> I fell and in Duras, he falls. Be careful, Dante. <laughs> Wait, I can't wait to edit that part, man. That's going to be sick. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no, no. <laughs> You wanna know some history? I'm gonna tell you some history. I am your tour guide. The amphitheater of Duras is a Roman amphitheater in the center of the city of Duras. 
Construction began under the emperor. <laughs> I can't pronounce that goddamn thing. Emperor, emperor, Trajan, Trajan, in the second century A.D. and it was destroyed twice by earthquakes in the sixth and the tenth centuries. We are in the region Illy Illyria, and that's why I think this is like Illyrian bloodline noises because it's like the real bloodline from the start from the beginning when we had history at school i never really listened much and like i didn't no, really did like I. <laughs> I didn't really care about like history but when i actually get to be in places where i get to see it i find it really beautiful like yeah. it's just like it's just amazing part of me just wants to go on the grass and like perform Family. <laughs> How's everybody? You guys okay? Lovely to meet you, Lovely to meet you guys. Oh. Yes. Yeah. We're out here with DK family. Love DK family. <laughs> we're gonna go to the castle now, and we've got DK family guiding us because we're not 100% sure where to go. Jeez. So I'm excited. And Dante, try not to fall because I don't want anything I'm else happening my step. to you. Don't worry, but you know what? The universe is amazing because we didn't know where the castle was, and then the universe like brought DK family to us and said, "Let them guide you." On the way to the castle, I see a man's head sticking out. I'm not sure who this man is, and I don't have Wi-Fi to search it up. So comment below, what's the history behind this man's head? From what I can see so far, I feel like the rest is lighter than Tirana, like it's more, like more light. Maybe it's because it's sunny, but I feel like even if it wasn't sunny, like the buildings are lighter and stuff. But anyway, it's, it's really beautiful. Like, I'm just looking at everything in such awe, like, oh. We made it to the castle. It looks really cool. I thought you could like go inside and stuff, but you can't. So it is what it is. It looks really cool from the outside. I wonder if those are like active cannons or were active. I think they were real cannons. They were used on a ship. This is so beautiful. I'm gonna touch it. Wow. Baby, these are real cannons that were used on the ship. And I think that's the captain. Baby, I just love it here. Like it's got that beach vibe. It's yeah, got the palm trees. It's I got... know. Oh, like, it's so it... like calm. I can just imagine in summer, this place must be heaven. Yeah, I'm telling you. Like it just gives a different type of vibe compared to Tirana. Like Tirana is the city. It's where everything's at. But this gives you a relaxation type of vibes. Like you can just chill and just enjoy life and and have the sun beating down on you. Enjoy the weather. And palm oh. trees. I love palm trees. Careful. I think that's probably my favorite tree. I don't think you can go here. This is a roundabout. Oh, thank you. He let us pass. Maybe you, can go, you can cross the road anywhere in Albania. <laughs> you just have to. All right. And even though it's seven degrees, it still feels good. Like the sun is really hitting you and it feels warmer than seven degrees. I feel like I just want to take it all in. Mm, I feel so good.
Just bumped into some more DK family. Hi, DK family. Hello. Ready? Go. Our DK family is so kind, honestly. Ah! So we're at Ventus Harbor, and I want to walk over their bridge. I'm really excited. I love bridges for some reason. I just always find them so like cool, and I don't know, just soothing, you know? It reminds me of the one in America in GTA. I feel like people look at us like we're crazy because we're walking around the camera. Hi there, friend. I think Whoa, she's his got legs her legs are mangled open. up. <laughs> what is this? It's a foot. Oh, Albanian foundry art. Pierin Konkad. Konkai. 2016. <laughs> We're not allowed there. <laughs> We're not allowed. <laughs> Hello. Hello, how are you? What? Nice to meet you. Wow. This is beautiful. Super clear. Baby, I'm starving and the fish smell makes me starve even more. I'm hungry. Should we? <laughs> he said I'm hungry. Hungry. This is what you call art, guys. Art. Who is this imposter? She is stealing the sun rays. She's stealing them. Big step. You guys, this is so beautiful. I feel like I could just fall asleep on here. Guys, it was so magical up there. I am like, I love. But I'm starving and I really just want to find the perfect place to go eat now. We just checked the menu. Menu looks good. So we're going to get a seat. We're not going to talk too much because they are playing songs that can get potentially copyrighted. Very copyrighted. But the whole menu looks very yummy. So I ordered a cheeseburger because I haven't had a cheeseburger in like ages. Ages. And Dante went for the usual souflaki or souflache. Or and what souflage. we're going to do is like share it. So yeah. yeah. So we don't add like fatty cakes. A few moments later. Fresh and dead, yeah. Did you just see the way the dogs have to the side? That was so cute, guys. From what I see, obviously it's by the sea, so it's a seasonal place and a lot of businesses are shut. It's a lot quieter than Tirana. Yeah, a lot quieter. But they have a lot less people as well. Yeah. If you guys want a car wash, you know where to go. Get a shiny car. You'll see that. In Duras and Tirana, they have a lot of trash cans. Is it open, closed? Open, careful, it's wet. Okay. <laughs> oh, it looks good in here. It's good. Wow. I 
You want to try a little something from here. Did you like it? Um, I don't know. I think it's too sweet for my taste buds. Okay, thank you. Put him in daddy. Hi, DK family. This is the Museo Archaeologically and this is a really famous museum in Duras, so we're gonna see if we can go inside there. I see a security man outside. We'll see what happens. Vamanos, vamanos. Wow, he's watching TV. <laughs> Guys, they closed at four o'clock and it's literally 3.54 right now. Oh, how did we miss this baby? Oh guys, we're sorry, we're sorry. Aww. I really wanted to see the museum, but obviously there's, there's always next time, so. Can I take a picture of you here? Of course. It's starting to get quite cold, so we're starting to make our way back to the hotel. And anything we see in the meantime will be a dope experience, so I look forward to seeing what comes our way. So we actually didn't get to show you guys the hotel we were staying at. This hotel right here. Epi Down Garden. Bye Doris, Bye, hopefully Doris. see you soon. Thank you for having <laughs> us guys, we appreciate you. We love you guys, it was an amazing experience. I do look forward to coming back here. Maybe, you know, whilst we're still here, but definitely in summer. Yeah, definitely in summer, 100%. Yeah. Okay, I'm sorry. Oh I'm sorry. And that is what you call a professional. <laughs> Go, so I can eat my sushi. And I do have to say, and I do have to say, Zins was amazing. I am so full up right now. I'm ready to collapse on my bed. What are you doing? <laughs> I said, bro, she's pushing open the door like this. <laughs> let, me, let me use my magic hands. No, Come. stop it. I am an independent woman. I'm an independent woman. May I sit like a queen? <laughs> <laughs> I'm so lucky I didn't get out my tracksuit. I have taken the dedication to... What? <laughs> <laughs> I have taken... The responsibility. Yes. I have taken the responsibility of taking... No. I have taken... <laughs> <laughs> Dante. Guys, we've made TikToks, we've had breakfast, we've uploaded a video, we've done all of our- I searched up some, so I done, I done some background. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Bad, 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 bad boy. Mm. Hey DK family, getting cleaned. Construction began. <laughs> Construction began under the emperor. <laughs> you want me to read? Construction began under the emperor. Emperor. <laughs> Come on. That's Wait, it. What is the shit filming? Come on, show me. <laughs> exactly. So film. Show me. Right. I need to tell him some history. On 2021, this man named Dante Leonard fell on the stairs <laughs> flat on. 